What is up you guys, this is FS Madness Pilot and today we have a very nice video on sharing your cockpit in FS2020. Now one of our lovely friends uh, at GitHub has created this lovely uh, repository which is called uh, Your Control which basically allows uh, users to do shared cockpit uh, through the SIM Connect in the new Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020. Uh, it is just released, so it has a lot of bugs, but I'm trying to make everyone aware of it so people can go ahead and help aiding the development of this uh, awesome project that someone has created. So let me show you guys how you can set it up. So the first thing is go to the link that's down below in the description. It should take you to GitHub, as you can see. Now when you're here, you're going to press on the releases and go ahead and download the zip. Once you download the zip, go ahead and extract it into a folder on your desktop or anywhere else and extract the contents inside. Now once you have everything extracted and inside the folder, you can now go ahead and start this installer which is the VC Redist x64.exe now once you start it you're going to install it and it's going to ask you to restart your computer and once you restart your computer you can come back to this tutorial you can go ahead you and your friend uh, after doing the same steps is go ahead and spawn at a airport in fs2020 the same location gate aircraft and time and preferably I would uh, request if you guys can go ahead and turn off your traffic and turn off your multiplayer so you don't see two planes on top of each other now once you have that already and you guys are both in cold and dark state you can go ahead and both open the shared cockpit.exe now as you can see once I've opened the shared cockpit.exe it comes up with this dialog which asks for a client and a server so for this example I have my friend he's the server and he's gonna start the server and I'm gonna go ahead and press connect so is the server on uh, yep yep go ahead server is on okay. landing gear landing gear landing gear now as you can see it's landing. a bit buggy Okay, it's it's a bit buggy, but uh, like we tried it with the Cessna 172, and it works pretty flawlessly. Um, but you know, there's there's a lot of issues because it's the first release. But I'm pretty sure, like in a month or two, um, he's gonna iron out the bugs. But uh, Kentari, can you move your your throttle? Can you move your yoke? Can you... Yeah, yeah, sure, sure. Hold on, hold on. it. There you go. Can you see it? Yep, you're moving it. And this is this is awesome for for like uh, Vatsim flights. We can do like uh, share cockpit flights on Vatsim, which would be very immersive. Uh, you can have someone sitting in the right seat doing all the FMC work, and someone is actually doing the flying, which is very immersive in the new Microsoft Flight Simulator. But anyways, this is just me showcasing that someone is actually working on it, and I want to give him all the credits and hopefully some people can go ahead and help him out and yep yeah, uh, thank you guys for watching and thank you Torit for helping out and no hopefully everything is gonna get awesome sooner bye bye that's when this fight out